constant though is the wonderful Lionel Messi. He's back to wow us all once again. Still, you know at any point in, in any game, he can produce a bit of magic and win a game for his team. It took 2011 to end the countrywide curse. England's biggest thing. And I saw him practice one day and I thought, hmm? well, what's that? <laughs> I asked Giovanni from Broncos, who's that? Oh, that's Lionel Messi. He's from Barca Bay. He's going to come with us now. Mm. He was good then, yeah. but I could never. Cho sprinkling some stardust onto a game that's full of world stars. The five times Champions of Europe. <laughs> against Real Madrid last season. A repeat of that performance may well be required tonight. Often does for Tottenham Hotspur. And there's Luis Suarez, who's back here as well. It might not pay off because how good this side are, at, you know, playing between the lines and taking the ball under pressure, as we can see here. It's a majestic ball by Messi, Jordi Alba. Here's an opportunity straight away for Barcelona that's thundered in by Felipe Coutinho. The finish was brilliant from the Brazilian. The initial through ball from Messi, quite sublime. Tottenham nil, Barcelona won, and the worst possible start for Spurs at Wembley. Well, those are the risks that you run when you try and play on the front foot. For the first time since December 2016, they've not got... This Harry Winks, who had uh, Artur in there, snapping at his heels. Now Messi on the move. And caught there by Victor Wanyama. Yeah, the early signs are not good for Tottenham. You know, there's a couple of runs there that Luis Suarez has made. If the ball's better, he's in on. Here's Ivan Rakitic. Now Messi. It's a great example of Messi and the freedom he gets. Left back and then suddenly pops in, in behind Son. No. Here's Winks. Now Trippier. Back. Team doing his defensive. Messi. Jan Vertonghen tonight, which when you look around the Spurs team, the likes of Deli Ali and Moussa Dembele and Christian Eriksen, all big pull, Luis Enrique. He's only lost six of 68 matches. In Lionel Messi over the free kick here for Barcelona. An acre around him all the time. In goes the free kick. Barcelona get it back again here. The work was being done defensively by Busquets on Mora. Suarez to Messi. Davis. See Busquets still being worked on on the far touchline by the Barcelona medical team. Seems to be quite a severe massaging of the thigh stroke groin at the moment for the Messi looking to play Jordi Alba in he needs support in the middle with Lamella and Son playing ahead of him keep an eye on how long that lasts here's Messi for here's Messi he clips it in towards Luis Suarez and then Chester down to Coutinho Danger still not away, Rakitic onto it, oh what a hit, what a goal by Ivan Rakitic, an outrageous volley by Rakitic, it's Spurs nil, Barcelona two, and that's a special goal. Well it's a wonderful goal and it's also a wonderful team goal, although it's a wonderful team. Stunning, stunning goal by a man who was such an important port, part of the uh, Croatia team that did so well in the World Cup in the summer, it's his second goal of the season. And it's a real steep climb back for Tottenham now, uh, even with a area of scoring goals from distance. We need to show him why again. And Messi's got Suarez in. It's a fantastic ball by Messi. Suarez. Full backs forward now. Here come Barcelona the other way with Messi. This game's wide open, which you don't really want. Goal after 27 minutes. Here's Lionel Messi for Barcelona. Jordi Alba. And Coutinho was the target. Alda Vierald in the way. Here's Messi. Busquets. Alba to Messi. Uh, here's Messi. Looking to nick it away from Davis. He's been able to do it. Now Luis Suarez. Times at the moment for Tottenham, 2 0 down, and Messi coming forward. A deflection. Now, don't forget, there's some uh, Europa League football to tell you about tomorrow. Karabag against Arsenal. That's from 5 15 on 2 HD. Uh, this is for Tottenham, but you have to keep reiterating the fact that they're so short handed tonight. With yeah. There is a huge amount of space there, that he, and he thinks, I can, if I can get. Not a centre forward. There's a yellow card there for Wanyama for the challenge on Messi. Yeah, the front two for Tottenham at the moment are Hyung Min Son and Eric Lamella and part of his game that he does drift towards. And he's back up there again now. 
Here's Messi, Artur, Messi, now Semedo. Tour fouled by Lamella. And he looks a really good player, Artur. He's like a mini Jave. I know he's only 22, but what a. He looks a replica of a Jave. Here's Suarez who's going to hit one. Messi floats one in here towards Coutinho. Easy as the ball was being set from Ordovero. He's got to make sure he's onside. And Messi collides with Kieran Trippi. The decision's gone Barcelona's way. I think he got the throwing. and they get faced up, they do look a little bit dangerous. That's an excellent ball by Sergio Busquets, who got it forward quickly to Messi. He can glide away from Sanchez, and still, Messi hits the post! Well, the initial run was fantastic, and when he pulled the trigger, I think most people inside Wembley thought 3-0 Barcelona. Well, look at him, he's just passing the ball into the corner, he's tried to... he's beaten the keeper, Lloris, just hits the post and comes back, but that's, that's the problem Spurs have got gone way forward, attacking down the left-hand side. We lo you know, lose the ball in the centre of midfield and pop one pass out. Here's that opportunity with Messi. I mean, I have to say, look, it's brilliant for Messi, as we know, but I thought on the chance to really try and make an impact. Yeah, he was just having a fight with the ball, wasn't he? Here's a man who can make an impact in a hurry. Messi's away from Wanyama. Next on the agenda, Alderweireld, Alder, and he hits the same post from just about the... Artur, now Messi side have got the experience and they'll respond but that'll give Spurs a lot of confidence it's Messi in central midfield so far tonight yeah that's about the first ball he's given away not poor one to Harry Kane but for Victor Wanyama here's Artur for Barcelona into Messi spotted the run from left back of Jordi Albert here's Coutinho leaves it for Suarez and Messi and this time he squeezes the ball in and in the blink of an eye, the two-goal lead restored for Barcelona and restored by the little magician Lionel Messi. It's Tottenham 1, Barcelona 3. You know, sometimes, Fletch, you just have to applaud brilliance. You really do. He has orchestrated absolutely everything that has been brilliant about Barcelona this evening. From deep positions, from high up, he's hit the left-back position. Here's Messi. The referee was having none of that. These positions here, they, they entice you in. Messi just picks up positions to go and get the ball. And when they're in this mood, they're still the time. It's camp in, park the bus and try and break us down. Yeah, there's a problem when he picks up the ball in this kind of space, threads it through to Suarez. He's been virtually unplayable, Glenn, in these kinds of positions Look at the tonight. Pass. Well, there's been another goal in the other game taking place in Group B tonight, and Mauro Icardi, who scored against Tottenham, has put into... Here's Lionel Messi. Offside hat from Harry, when he drops in there, but then he looked to get in behind, Davis didn't quite find him, but sometimes drop in there and he stays in there for me too long, but he made a fantastic... ...work, and, um, you know... It... They've got this guy who... who Lloris under all kinds of pressure from Suarez. And then Messi looking to latch onto it. Messi in. Alder brilliant tackle. Jermaine Genus is sat next to me holding his head in his hands. He can't believe what he's seeing here. I, I, I mean, one part of it is absolutely brilliant from Lloris. Kind of getting his mate up. It's so open the game now, isn't it? Here's Messi. Suarez, Ivan Rakitic. Lionel Messi. Alba's in an acre of space down at the equaliser. <laughs> Especially when this fella's got the ball. Well, that's the point, isn't it? If you're in a little bit above a Barcelona, just give it to the magic man. There's Coutinho, Semedo, Messi. Realistically, you, you know, the tension shouldn't be there. The game should be, you know, dead and buried from Barcelona's point of view, but... 
you've got to give Spurs credit. You really have. They've taken the belief, they're working hard, and they're doing this to get... Suarez to Messi. And of all, the way he's balanced and the way he turns away from players. Look at the space he's got now, Messi. Excellent tracking back. That will deliver. You can see Rafinha preparing himself as well on the Barcelona bench. That'll be the first change for them. Now Messi. Suarez has drifted out wide. Messi always in support. Here's Messi. The game, I don't know whether he's just had 10 minutes off and thought you lot deal with the rest of this or, or he's just a little bit... Gets it back here from Harry Kane, challenged by Vidal. Here's Messi. Loose ball picked up by Messi, who for once didn't find the intended target due to a very acrobatic header by Ben Davis. A real battle there between Messi and Alderweireld. Yeah, a real battle. I mean, you can't... Albert's nicked it ahead of Sissoko, little dummy by Suarez. Messi can finish it at Wembley and does. Lionel Messi, second goal tonight, and he is so clinical for Barcelona. And in the last minute of the 90, Messi gets his second goal, and it's Tottenham 2, Barcelona 4. I'm sorry, but Lloris, in this, there's a minute to go. Tottenham need a goal. What is he doing? Passing to Trippier. Trippier then plays it round the corner, and Sissoko has got to be strong and hold the ball up it's absolutely ridiculous obviously Messi it was that you don't ask for volunteers you've just got to give somebody the job <laughs> <laughs> yeah the problem you got there I think you can do that be if Inter Milan win their match tonight and Barcelona beat them here it'll be six points out of six for those two and Tottenham and PSV who meet in back-to-back -back matches now reinforce the ranks to a large extent how you how and a majestic performance tonight from the Barcelona captain Lionel Messi two goals and two more shots that came back off the Tottenham post. It was a masterclass, a virtuoso performance by the little magician from Tottenham. Harry Kane with a goal back for Spurs, which gave them hope. And Eric Lamella, likewise, was a man who could raise the temperature inside the stadium. Felipe Coutinho was the man who got the ball rolling very early inside a minute and a half for Barcelona.